Now your certified storm ready forecast from NBC 25. Well, how things can vary over a relatively short distance. We took a look at Flint earlier where it was and probably still is snowing. Here's a look at downtown Saginaw via our NBC 25 sky cam and the sun is actually trying to peek through as it sets for the evening. Uh, you can see all the snow on the side of the roads, so the streets, at least the main ones, not in too bad a shape, but watch out for slick spots, especially on the secondary roads and untreated surfaces. As we look at the satellite radar composite right now, we do have a little bit of snow out there and uh, it is primarily confined to our southern counties. As we mentioned, Flint over into Lapeer County to Chiawassee County getting some light snow where you see the darker blues here just to the southwest of Flint uh, towards Fenton. The snow is coming down a little bit heavier, but it shouldn't be enough to cause uh, any accumulation. Just some slippery spots on some of the untreated surfaces. But bitterly cold air is expected to arrive later tonight. Then some sun is expected tomorrow. Despite that, temperatures don't respond. We'll stay in the low to mid teens. And then another chance of snow this weekend. It doesn't look like as big of a weather system as what we had to deal with on Super Bowl Sunday, but still enough snow to impact your travel plans on Saturday. 8 p.m. tonight, still a few flurries out there, especially coming off of Lake Michigan and some of our northern counties. So watch out for that if you're heading north of Saginaw Bay. Then at 7 o'clock in the morning, you can see some breaks showing up in the clouds and becoming mostly sunny by 3 p.m. But don't let the sun fool you. It will be bitterly cold. A few flurries in the wee hours on Friday morning. And then as we head into Friday afternoon, a break or two here or there. But overall, Friday looks like a cloudier but milder day. This weekend system, this is what we expect from it as of right now. On Friday night, it should take place to the west of us near the Mississippi River. And then as we advance into your Saturday night, that low will pass in neighboring states to the south of us, Ohio and Indiana. Right now, it looks close enough that it could bring some accumulation. I think the heaviest of the snow will generally stay to the south of us, but anywhere from around Flint southward will have to be on guard for some accumulating snow Saturday into Saturday night. That could amount to three to maybe five inches, but we'll keep you posted. Three below zero tonight, but wind chills around 10 below. Only 13 for a high tomorrow despite sunshine. Wind chills struggling to get much above zero even during the afternoon. Extended forecast, not as cold tomorrow night. We'll start to see a southwest wind develop. Friday's high up to 28. Closer to average, partly sunny, some snow Friday night right through both days over the weekend. In fact, some sleet may mix in on Saturday. And again, myself and Ahmed Baji on NBC 25 today, tomorrow morning. We'll keep you posted on the snow totals.